Example. So in this example, we have the following scenario. Question says, evaluate the line integral of function 2x along with curve C. And curve C is defined as C1 which is parabola y equals to x squared from the origin to the point one and one, and followed by vertical line segment C2 vertical line from one and one and stops at one and two. Okay, so here we have a function, this is my function, f, and I have c, which divided up into two pieces. Let's take a look at the graph together. Very good. So c1, which is y equals to x squared, I have this guy here, 0, 0 to 1 and 1. This is my c1. And then c2 is just a vertical line from 1 and 1 to 1 and 2, c2. And I want to take the integral of this function along c, which has two pieces. So step by step, one, 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 we're going to try to um, calculate this integral. The integral of 2x ds over curve c can be divided up into 2x ds over c1 plus the integral 2x ds c2. Okay, let's calculate each one of these separately. On c1, you have a relation between x and y. Very good. On c1, the ds is equal to square root of dx dt squared plus dy dt squared. So on c1, if you write, let x be t, then y becomes t squared. So ds is equal to the square root of dx dt, 1 squared, plus dy dt, 2t squared dt. Okay, very good. This is your c1. Now what about c2? For C2, you have a vertical line, right? Your X is equal to one, your Y ranges between one and two. So X is one and the Y is equal to, for example, you can name it T or you can just leave it as it is. T is in between one and two. So, So your ds is equal to square root of the rate of change with respect to t is zero, zero squared plus one squared dt or just dt. So my line integral can be written as 2x ds is the integral over c1. I have 2x 2t times square root of one plus or t squared dt, and t is bounded between, as you can see, between 0 to 1. t and x are the same thing, and t ranges between 0 to 1. So let me add all of these here. And plus the integral, and here you have 1 to 2, 2x, x is just 1, 
So you're going to have two times one and ds, which is just d t. Very good. Let us do the calculation. Here you can use u sub. Your u is one plus four t squared. Du is eight t dt. So this guy is equal to one fourth times, and you have u two a half. 1 over 3 halves, 1 plus 4 t squared, 2 3 halves, 0 to 1, plus 2 t, 1 to 2. So this guy becomes 1 over 6. If I plug in 1, I have 5 to 3 halves, minus 1, and here I have four minus two. So let's see what's the output here. Five times square root of five minus one divided by six plus two. If you want to do um, an approximation, you need to use a calculator to see uh, what is this decimal value. But this is the line integral. This is the integral of this function along this Curve. As the function, the ceiling is 2x and it moves along this curve. This is the output of the integral. 